Hello everyone, this is Jade, and we're back with my time at Portia. And as I said, we're picking up right where we left off. This is back to back from the previous episode. And we're going to see if we can uh, get this milk delivered. I think there was somebody down here. And hopefully we can deliver to him. Is he still there? Oh. Um. Oh, there he is. Hey, stop. Now I can dig my dried fish and milk. Yum. Well, yay for you. Okay. Now we need to find the other two. I think Adit is up there. Okay, and it looks like somebody's right inside here. Isaac, maybe? So if we can catch Isaac. <clears throat> oh, perfect. Wait, why are you here? Oh, you're helping Sophie. <laughs> Thanks. All right. And we should be able to just take this DD right back up here. And then we can turn that one in. <clears throat> Thank you much. And hopefully he is in here. And again, I still, as I said, back to back. So I apologize for the noise that you may hear. Is he actually up in here? Can I go in here? Oh, this is Dawa's home? Uh, um, well, I get... Really? Can I find anything here that I can have? <laughs> Alright, well, I guess we'll have to come back and deliver his milk tomorrow. What time is it anyway? Eight o'clock? You people are going to bed at eight o'clock? What's the matter with you? All right. Well, we'll go see what our stuff is uh, looking like down here. I think we've talked to Jack before. So how are all our supplies going? Is that everything? So we may have all of those that we needed. And are we able to... Oh. So no bronze plates yet. I think we only needed two of those, right? Uh, two bronze bars. We probably need to learn this recipe. Right? There we go. Now... Where do we put these? Okay. So I think the only thing we need now... Okay, are just the bronze plates. And we need two for each side. I think we only have the one, so we're probably going to have to go get more bronze. Now... Uh, where did I leave the rest of this stuff here? So we have 20 of those. And we have 20 of these. And we have the money... So that's also what we're going to do. Okay, there's one bronze plate. I'm going to go ahead and put this over here. Put you in there. And I guess we'll hang on to this stuff. We're going to have to go get more bronze. So I think, actually, we're going to go ahead and store this stuff in here. And we'll put our data disks over here. We're going to get some sleep. you in here we're gonna get our thing upgraded and we're going to go and we're gonna get some more copper and tin so we'll get sleeping through the night here so what we should have oh well of course it failed cuz oh, that sucks oh well I tried to deliver it he was sleeping he wouldn't wake up I'm going to kick him in the head. Alright, so what do we got here? From the research center. We found something useful in the data disks you brought. Blah, 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 blah. Four days. <laughs> okay. Jade, the watermelons at our farm are ripe. Come and pick some. Ooh. Watermelons? I get watermelons? Okay. 
Oh, we got to check on the stew and all that, too. Um, straight up here. Let's get some watermelons. Because the stew and stuff, I don't know how long we have to do those. Watermelons, watermelons. Where's the watermelons? I'm into the watermelons <laughs> on my farm are ripe. Let's pick some. I'm sure they'll taste great. Sure. Okay. What do I get? It. What? The melons here are all ripe, but leave that big one alone. I call it Mr. Melon. So you want me huh? to? How come? Mr. Melon is my candidate for the autumn festival this year. At the rate it's growing, I reckon I have a good chance of winning. Do you have a competition for the Autumn Festival? Yeah, for the Autumn Festival. It's tradition here to do a town fair, and almost everybody shows up. There's lots of food and dancing and music and fun. At the center of it is the Best Bounty Contest, where many people bring out their best harvest of the year. Ever since I moved to my granny's ranch, I've participated in this competition every year. I've never won, though. I've always wanted to win that prize. Can you imagine me winning it? I'd be so happy. You should enter as well, just for fun. We can go together this year. It'll be a lot of fun. Anyway, let's hurry up and pick the melons. Okay, so I'm supposed to leave that one alone. Okay, is that all of them? That should be enough. Let's chow. Okay. Don't worry, Emily. I got my eye on a doctor or somebody, so just... Told you so. They taste super great, right? It's like a cool breeze in the summer. Yeah, this tastes really sweet. <laughs> I might not grow the biggest melon, but when it comes to sweetness, I've got this down pat. Don't worry. Mr. Melon is the biggest melon I've ever seen. I'm sure it'll win. I sure hope so. Well, I'm happy to hang out more, but it's time to take care of the farm. See ya! Bye, Emily! Alright. Oh, so we got pumpkin seeds, fertilizer. Okay. Cool. All right. So now we need to make a fish stew. What do I have here? I have a spicy fish stew. But I think we need um, the cooking stuff for that. And I think that's another one that we get out of the, the um, data disks. So we need a practice sword. And I think that is all Django wanted, so we'll take that. Oh, so it's a bronze sword. All right, so I need, yeah, we need more bronze for that. All right, well, that's okay. We can do that. Um, I don't know what we're going to do about the fish stew. And do we have any, I don't think we have any fertilizer. Oh, I do. Well, let's put you up here because I'm going to need you. And you are a quest. So let's check the status. Alright, let's go ahead and put these in here. Once we have more room, we'll get more farming going. But it's not like I have a, a ton of room right now to, to do a lot of stuff here. So let's put these in here. I think we already had some pumpkins. So we've got bamboo, wheat, cotton, and lettuce. And we probably are going to have to start growing like wheat and stuff like that. But we're going to go and we're going to upgrade our table thing here. So that's going to let us make bigger stuff. And then we need to go get some more copper and tin because we need more bronze. Hey, Albert. Okay. So, our assembly station. Upgrade. We have everything. 
Confirm. Look how big this thing is. Oh my. Where am I even going to put it? Oh my. It's huge. I don't think I can turn it <laughs> any different direction either. Uh, I may need to get that other table out of there. So we'll put that there for now. Um, okay. Oh. Hard aluminum construction crane, a silicone chipset, and goals. I've never done that before. Okay, well, that's fine. Um, what if I want to move this table? We need to move it. So where can we put this? I wish I could rotate the scene, but I can't. So let's put this here. And then we're going to move this if we can. Right there. Oh, we've got those chests in the way too. Okay. What did it move them then? Oh, probably because I couldn't move the these here. About that. All right. So now... Let's move you again. And see if we can fit you in right here. All right. So if it's just going to move them, then I can put those back where I need to move them because everything else can be moved except for these two things. So we definitely need to work on getting some more land so we can expand out just a little bit further because this thing is so huge. Oh, wait, what do we need? How much do we need to actually make the house bigger? And we probably are going to need. So your home has reached level two. Okay, well, it's not level two. But what do we need to upgrade it to level two? 20 hardwood planks and 20 bronze bars and 10,000 gulls. So, okay, so we can work on that. But I want to be able to get some, like, this coop. And stuff. And what does this take? So iron bars, some rope. Oops, no. But we we just need more room. And I'm not sure what the shed does. What do we need for that? So this stuff's not too bad. And the stable. Okay. I'd like to work on the house and maybe even the coop. Because then maybe we can get chickens. And then we'll have... Um, eggs that we can get from the chickens okay but for now do up let's go get some bronze while we're up here not bronze but some tin and some copper so we can make some bronze while we're here yes Hi, Toby. What are you doing here? Oh, it'll be fine. Okay. So let's find our... That looks like dirt still. Is that still... Is this... Okay. I think this is copper here. So we should hopefully be... Okay, yeah, we're going to get copper and tin from both. Oh, we gained a point. And as we dig down, we'll again focus, see if we can find some other relics. Okay, that's not what we need. All right, so let's see. We have anything in the vicinity. Yeah, oh, there's a bunch of stuff. Okay. So let's go see what we can find. Old parts and data disks. Data disks are good. Definitely need to get a bunch of those. Because I'm not sure how many things we still need to find. <sighs> There's so many things right here. Okay. And I'd like to actually turn some of that stuff in, too. Uh, where you can put the stuff together. High glass, okay. What else we got?
old parts, power stones. Oh, it looks like we don't even need to do the thing here. I got mining glasses here. Leather sofa. I don't think we have a sofa, do we or do we? We might. I don't remember. This was supposed to be getting copper and tin. This has turned into going after all these little shinies. Shinies get you into trouble every time. <laughs> Structural dimension theory? What the heck is that? Oh, look at that. That mine's nice. You just make a tunnel. All right, well, what else we got? There we go. Mm -hmm. More data disks. What is that thing we found? A book from the old world about structural design from a mathematical perspective. Can we actually do anything with that? It's like, does that give us... Um, apparently not. Maybe we can sell it. It's worth 125. Because it doesn't look like it does anything for us. Alright. Any more shinies? Aw. Oh. Way up there. No, you gotta look up. Pick. Okay, see if we can climb up here and get this. Find spots to stand. Oh, what are you? New relic discovered porcelain water holder. Alright. Oh my god, I think I'm trapped underground. Where's our... Okay, we went that way. <laughs> way over... Somewhere. Okay, let's get... Let's, let's get out of this hole. Uh... Okay. And just fall into another one. Can we see anything else up here? There's one right there. We're gonna need bricks and stuff anyway, over time, I'm sure. So it's not gonna hurt to have the sand and the bricks and... Or the sand and the stone so you can make the bricks and the glass and all that. Is that another eye thing? Oh, and a racket. Okay, I think we have one of those already. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, right there. I think we have, like, course pieces that we've not found everything. Rusty iron pipe. We're gonna need that for something. I just don't remember what. But I do remember using that at one point for something. Now we can head off that direction, I suppose. We're going to be running out of stamina pretty soon. But it's like, I need that cooking. I'm kind of hoping that those discs that I turned in, I'm kind of hoping that uh, maybe that's what we get. That cooking set. I don't think we have a time limit on those particular ones. But what is that? Weird glass jar piece three. Do we have... I don't know if we have all the pieces for that. It's probably a duplicate. We probably already have it. Well, let's head off in this direction. How much do we have? We've got... Hmm, 106 and 28. 
I think we need more copper than we do tin, but, and I know we still have some back at base, or back at the house, so. Power stone data disks, okay. What is, oh, I'm getting experience for mining. Makes sense. Oh, we're in a big old copper. What? Weird glass jar piece one. Okay. We will take that. Someday, eventually, I'll actually find all the pieces to something. Oh, what are you? I don't have enough space in my inventory. Um. <laughs> I don't think there's anything we could get rid of. Yeah, there's not. I could get rid of the dirt, I guess. Um, abandon. All 78. Power stone, old parts, data disk, and another book. Okay, well, that's not bad because then we can just sell it. That's 250. Okay. Well, we probably ought to head on out then, because I can't pick up anything else. I need to look and see what to do. Let's see. Let's get out of here. Alright. Uh, move to the entrance. Of course, I confirm it. So we'll do that. We're going to go back, get some of this stuff smelting up oh once you have a photo frame you can choose a photo for it and hang it on the wall oh cool all right we'll have to look into that see it's only 19 1910 so it's not that late it's like seven o'clock well let's get some of this stuff going I'm gonna get this bronze cooking. Oh, yep, and here we go. So we'll have to see about moving some of this stuff. There's our assembly station. Look at that. We can come up here and look. I'm not sure where it moved my my things to. It was supposed to move them. Um, that's kind of concerning. Oh, no. Odds and ends. Wooden storage. Okay. Alright, so it did move them. I just have to find a better spot for them, which is probably going to be over here somewhere. But I want to get this bronze going. Are you empty? Um, okay. You get moving on the bronze. And I think we're going to grab just a little bit more wood. Because I want that thing to keep going. At least overnight. It's probably not going to cook all of that. I mean, it's... Tw oh, okay. Fine. <laughs> Let's put some of this stuff away. Get that put away. We can do sand in here. We can do rocks in here. Um, no, I've got someplace else for you. All right, but that's at least enough so we can pick this wood up. Okay. Wow. Wow. We have deforested the area. So let's, let's get a little bit of this here. We need a smelter or something that actually runs on those power stones. Okay, we'll take you down. So it's going to take like two days. Okay. So you're full. This will run for one day and 15 hours. Yet it's going to take two days and 20 hours to cook all that. Okay then. So we've got, let's see, relics here. We can throw these power stones will go in there. And we can probably take more data disks down when she's done. And we need to find out. Okay, so we do have two of those. 
So weird glass jar piece three, weird glass jar piece one. So if we keep these at least maybe close, what is this? Old talker piece three. So we've got a few more pieces of this stuff to find. What I may have to do is put those in a different uh, chest. And this is just attack plus 10. So this is, I would have to actually equip that. And I don't know that... Because that's going to give me max stam stamina, max hit points. I'm, I'll probably hang on to that because that's something that we can use later. Like when we know we're going into um, like the ruins or something for like fighting and, and whatnot. And we already have one of these anyway. Uh, can I actually sell that? That's not worth much. Oh, and I've already got stuff up there. Can I just stack it there? Nope. Okay. Well, fine. All right, well, let's get some sleep. I guess we can put put this in here for now. Uh, we we'll probably sell these. And I forgot we got this porcelain water holder piece that I should probably put out there. I really do need to bring another chest in here and, and make that stuff. Uh, oh, we also have, before we forget, because I always forget, we have another skill point. Now the question is, what do we want to do with it? Um, let's see, maximum stamina. I'm not really worried about the social right now. I'm just trying to get some stuff here. So we could get double drops from this, which might be better to go with because we've got food that we can get stamina back. So let's go ahead and take that. Uh... I wonder how many more we need before we can get this. Add five skill points to each level. So we need a few more for that. All right. And we can probably put this back down too. I think this will give us a little bit more. Let's see. I put it. No. No, it doesn't want to go that way. Well, I'm not trying to face the wall. There we go. All right, so hopefully that gave us a little bit more as well. Okay. So I think there's... Was it this here? Max seven. So I don't... Okay, and this gives me seven. So that's good. But we don't have... A helper but we could tell them okay that's good stop gathering stuff or or whatever so that's that's perfect and this will tell us what they're up to so we could actually gain more stuff i think we're we're almost maxed and when we can get out of stamina and it's probably just for this house so other things that we're going to want to work on is probably finding things that will increase attack and defense and health so let's see where we're at out here. We have any mail? No mail. We should probably pick that catfish, salty catfish up. All right. Um, and I need to move these because odds and ends. <laughs> where can we put this? Maybe we can just put it over here. Next to farming. And you are wooden storage. Whoops. No, I'm just going to pick you up. And I can probably just put this over here, I think, for now. Can I squeeze that in there by any chance? Yes, I can. Which means that you are not back far enough, I bet. Can I put you back? Okay. There. Okay. And I'm going to see where did I put the workbench all the way back here I want to see if I can make another oh new stuff in here we're gonna make another one of those what do you need for metal storage okay so I just need glass and bronze plates I do need to make some of those but for now I just want to make one because I'm gonna put some stuff in there you've only made one really 
Are you kidding me? So we can maybe get another plate going at least. Okay, you go ahead and get that going. Now, do we have anything in here maybe that didn't register? Oh, I'd have to pick that. Oh, no, wait. I think I can just click handbook. I don't know that we have anything else in here. The industrial cutter. So we're definitely going to want to make one of those. But we need circuits, carbon steel. And I think we're, we're missing some things, obviously. Okay. So we'll let that go. Oh, I need the, just the plates. So this thing has got to keep going. And where's I using? Yeah, those go in there. And then we need a bunch of bronze. So, oh, have we talked to Ginger? I think we've talked to Ginger. I heard from Papa that you found the town thief. Yeah. Oh, yeah. By accident, really. You see? <laughs> what a surprise. Running into the bandy rat prince like that. But you beat them all. You must be getting good at ruin diving. Thanks for telling me your adventure. I really love the story. Have you been to the collapsed wasteland yet? I heard there's dangerous, hazardous ruins in there. It's like a restricted area near our town. Only certain qualified people can go in there. The ruins are indeed very dangerous. Let me tell you all about it. Wow. So, <laughs> it's full of dangerous toxins? And there were all types of creatures in there? Sounds like a really amazing experience. When you have time, can you tell me about your other adventures? Sure thing. Wow. Okay. Lots of points with her, huh? It's getting late. Alright. So we're going to let that bronze plate go. How are you doing in here? Oh, probably because... Didn't we get in? Probably all the mining maybe that we did. I don't know. Can we make... Let's get you going. Uh, and we're going to go ahead and see if we can get this one going as well. Whoops. No, not glass. Bronze. Craft all the bronze. Alright. So hopefully out of that we should get something going. Oh, it is late. It's going to knock us out here in a minute. Why was she out so late? Wow. Okay. I wanted to put... Um, I'm running out of time. I want to at least put this down here. Uh, because we'll put the relic pieces in there. Yep, go to sleep before you knock me out. I'll just fall over. That'll be that. <laughs> okay. So we're going to rename this... Um, I don't know what they're called. I don't know if it's just relic pieces. And we'll put, start putting these pieces in here. So we have just a separate spot to keep them. So unfortunately it's gonna be probably a couple more days before we hear back about uh, whatever it is we're gonna get our recipe for again. Where's our relics here? So we're going to take these pieces out. All right. And that way we can keep track of them a little bit better, hopefully. No, wrong one. And maybe we can kind of keep them separated out just a little bit. But at least we know where to look. Because I think that's all we have right now. That's piece two and piece three. Piece one. And then piece one and piece three. So we still need a second one on that. I've never found all of them before. I've not ever found all of one even before. Okay. So 
so we should hopefully be able to make this. Let's see, how many more do we need? So we've got two, so we need, I think, two more. Uh, can I only make one? Still? Okay, fine. Let's go ahead and put these down. So we'll wait for that other one. And you still have, you still have fuel. And you still have fuel. All right. So let's see. He wants a bronze sword and I still need a bunch of bronze for that. So let's see what we got in here. We've got, let's see, a wall light. Max health plus 18. So we need some glass for that. So we can do that. Um, dining table. We don't need anything for stamina. That gives us max health. I don't... Oh, do I have carbon steel? I just don't have any Asteria, so I need to gather those or probably buy them. A wooden photo frame. So we can make wooden photo frames. Oh, wooden music box. Now that's stamina. Health. Oh, I could do that probably if I just cut some wood there. What's a drying rack do? Drying food and other items? I wonder if we should make one of those. Cultivation fence. Oh, okay. Do I need to make these? Or did I do these already? Tree of claws. There's a weapon rack. Beeswax. Advanced composite board. Oh, I'm not doing that anytime soon. Did I make those things already? I thought I did. Honestly, do not remember. But they're not listed under here for a mission. So I must have done something with them already. Um, what can we make then? A wall light so we would need to make some glass so we're probably gonna have to get some of that going maybe we can why don't you go ahead and start making some of that we've got to make some more of these um, civil furnaces and stuff too and you've got like what another hour in game time all right we're gonna be a while for this stuff here so what are we gonna do I have no idea Do we have any bait? Maybe we should... Well, let's let's take a look and see what we've got up here. If anybody needs anything. Those are all the DD stops. These are all fishing spots. I don't know that you can collect anything different on these spots. Well, we've got areas that we want to just, like, get opened up, too. But we definitely need a DD stop down here. Let's see what's going on over here. Because like I said, I don't remember. I thought I made that tree, but I don't remember. What? What the heck? Oh, okay. So it looks like I do still need to make that stuff. All right. Well... <laughs> Let's go take a look and see what we need to do with that because we're probably going to want those. I completely forgot. And it's like I said, it's not showing up in my list, so. Let's go see what we need to do for those. Maybe we can get that done today. Before we end, because I know we're getting close to needing to stop anyway. Um, you're giving me all enough stuff here. Ooh, and you're done. Which means I can tell you to make one more. For now. And let's see what we need here. 
See, because it doesn't show up here. Tree of Claws. Did I make these? I guess not. So I need copper wire, I need five glass, and we need three wood. So in order to make the sign, we're going to need five hardwood planks. Oops. Okay. So let's get those started. We may actually have to finish this up next episode. And this needs just glass and just some wood. So we can go out and chop a few trees. I've got the copper wire. And if I remember, I think we've got some um, glass cooking up. But we've really got to get money together too because we really need to expand. And then we can start probably making stuff and selling it as well. Okay. Well, that should hopefully be enough wood. So is glass all we need then? Yeah, we just need glass. Five glass. And I've got the pigments. That's all I have are those two pigments. And then we just need the wood from the civil cutter. Which is going to take a bit of time to actually get done. It's still eight in-game hours. This is just about done. Um, so we might be able to get this bronze plate before we go and actually get our first DD stop placed. Fuel depleted. Great. Okay. So you go ahead and do that. And then we need to just gather up enough stuff here. Oh, you're still... Oh, wait. I don't want to spend all of the stuff there. There we go. So there's our first DD stop. So we're going to go ahead, I think, and place the first one down here. Just so we can get across here. And then we'll have to put one up. I do definitely want to put one in the wasteland. So there's one of them. When there are two or more DD stops, you can take a ride from one stop to another. Well, I know that I've already done it. <laughs> okay, so there's that one. And I think we might be able to make... Do we just need five ingots to make that sword? Well, we're not going to have time to probably turn that in today. Come on, pick it up. But I just want to see. Bronze sword, we do have enough. So we'll craft that, and then we will actually turn that in next time. And uh, hopefully our glass will be going, and we're probably going to have another back-to-back -back episode because of that. And then we're going to have to keep going because we've got to get these DDs going. Actually, what I may do is I may just finish out the day. Um... And try to get just some stuff going as we're making stuff. And then um, hopefully be able to get some of this stuff built. So, yeah, I'm just going to work on just, like, smelting. I'll probably just go out and gather some wood and stuff like that while this stuff is cooking up. And then we'll just start the day fresh. So thanks for watching, guys. And we will see you next time. Bye.